Hey everybody, Tim the Tone Priest here. We have a super de duper de episode for you today. We have one hell of a shootout here between four transparent overdrive pedals. These are all clone builds that I built. Uh, this guy I built like completely from scratch with perf board or strip board, I forget which. This is a Thorpey Peacekeeper. And then these other three I built using pedalpcb.com PCBs. Wer sind denn ihre drei fashion -Begleiter? We have the Greer Lightspeed. Enzo go long. We have the Mighty King of Tone. Antonio Margheriti. And I just whipped this sucker together yesterday. Uh, this is a Paul Cochran Timmy. Dominique de Coco. And they all sound very good. There's different things I like about each of them. For instance, the Peacekeeper, just smooth. That's all I can say. It's smoother than a Coors Light. That's what I like about that one. The Greer Lightspeed Gourlami. is the best thing to happen to Telecaster neck pickup since, I don't know, Electron, I don't, I don't even know. I'm trying to think of something funny and I, I'm coming up with nothing. Uh, bear in mind, I, uh, I'm i a moron and I got the knobs in backwards, so up is down, down is up, and you can kind of tell by the the uh, the letters here. So the big V is higher, little V is, you, you know what I'm saying. Uh, King of Tone. Margarete. Just sounds fantastic. Great pedal. Sounds great. Does everything great. Just great. Very versatile. You have uh, high gain and low gain. You can do them both at the same time, and just great. And then the Timmy Dominic de Coco, bravo! I whipped together yesterday. I haven't played around with it a whole lot just yet. Um, we'll see. Seems pretty good, but when you got competition like the King of Tone and the Thorpey Peacekeeper and the uh, Greer Lightspeed, yeah, it's a tough crowd right here. But uh, who knows? We got to uh, record some, some master licking by the Tone Priest and listen back to the recordings and let the tail of the tape decide what's what here. Um, so, like, uh, it seems like everybody likes to do pedal demos using a Blackface Fender Deluxe Reverb or a Deluxe Reverb reissue. And I was like, hey, I got this thing in the closet, which is a clone build of a Blackface AB763 Deluxe Reverb. Perfect. So that's what we're going to use. We'll be just like everyone else, we will not stand out from the crowd. We will assimilate. Resistance is futile. Alright, uh, blah blah blah. Here we go. Just going to try and do a bunch of quick little licks of each. I'm a horrible guitar player, so bear with me, but I'll do the best I can. And uh, let me know what you think down in the thing below. Here we go. If John Bollinger is out there watching, this is the rig we'll be using. We have our SX custom handmade vintage series Telecaster shaped object. It looks yeah. legit. Yeah, uh, it looks legit. And this very possibly could be the uh, last time you hear this guitar and in this configuration here. It's about to get a very major upgrade to one of the components so you know savor it while you can the recording setup we have today is the aforementioned blackface deluxe clone uh we have this thing what is it an mxl dx2 sounds very similar to a 57 but it's got its own thing going on but uh nothing fancy sounds pretty good uh this amplifier has an eminence Speaker in it. Let's see if we can get in there. Can we see? Yeah, there we go. It's got that. Eminence 1058. I believe that's a legend. Unlike the person playing the guitar. And then that's going into this interface. Straight into Reaper. And there are the notes, if you want to copy them. Well, that's, a, that's amazing. All right, hopefully you can see everything there. Let me get Reaper rolling here, and then we'll uh, begin. Uh, go. Do one of these. Nope. Try that. 
Try again. Take two. Do one of these. Uh, that's the one thing I don't like the King of Tone is it is noisy when you engage it or disengage it. I'm going to see if I can do something about that, but until then, just freaking deal with it. Uh, clean tone. again. Damn, that sounds good. Uh, high gain, I think. Alright, let's do that again. This... Quiet down. This thing is blasting me. Uh, take two on the, uh, Timmy here. Noisy. But it could be because everything's just, it's a mess here. It's not very good for anything. Um, let's see what we can do. We'll do a little uh, volume knob stuff.
Yeah, the Timmy's uh, definitely growing on me for sure. Um, all right, we'll try and do a little soloing a little bit. Uh, I'm going to do it in the neck pickup. And like I said, the, the Greer light speed is the best thing to happen to telecast a neck pickup since... Titan condom! <gasps> George! Uh, screws? I don't know. I got nothing. Put it down in... in Put it down in below in the comments what this is the next best thing since... You know what I mean. say for the uh, soloing and the neck pickup the Timmy uh, is giving the, the light speed a, a good run for its money but that's just my opinion you can be the judge of that all right to wrap this up I'm just gonna have a little fun and um, do some old standbys here I think my playing was uh, sufficient for today's demonstration.
And I don't mean to sound contrary here. The word good falls tragically short of encompassing the sheer virtuosity of your performance this evening. Um. They all have their thing. I like them all. I mean, again, this guy's smoother than a Coors Light. This guy is great for soloing, especially on the, on the neck pickup. King of Tone just sounds wonderful. And the, uh, the Timmy's really growing on me. I think it's the second best for soloing on the neck pickup. Um, it does seem a little bit noisy, but that could just be because, you know, I'm next to an amp and Variax and lights and computers and more computers, so, and I'm sitting, like, two feet away from it with single coil pickup, so, you know, grain of salt on that, but, uh, wow, I love them all. It's like, how do you choose between your kids, right? Um, yeah, there you go. Let me know what you think. I'm uh, very curious to know. All right, everybody, hope you enjoyed it. Uh, I want to thank you if you give me a thumbs up. And I uh, want to remind everyone we're having a Patreon going on uh, September 1st. Anybody that signed up to my Patreon, we're going to raffle this sucker off here. King of Tone Clone. And uh, if you win it, you get it. That's all there is to it. So uh, check that out. We're doing a bunch of cool stuff. We're going to be building a Dumble soon. So what the hell, man? Five bucks. It's nothing. Hook it up. Hook a brother up. All right. Thanks again, everybody. Rock on. Diablos! Number one! Yeah! Done!